It's the season of giving. But unfortunately, consumer protection experts say there are people out there who will take advantage of your generous spirit. We do see a large uptick in fraudulent scams posing as charities trying to solicit money from people during the holiday season. Brandon Garrod is head of the Consumer Bureau for the AG's office. He says one popular way scammers try to trick you out of your cash is over the phone. He says if you don't recognize a number, don't pick up. And if you do talk to someone asking for money, watch out for a high-pressure pitch. That's a huge red flag. If the, the person on the phone is you know, insisting that a person donate money before the end of the phone call or donate immediately, um, it's probably a scam. A legitimate charity will, would love to accept your money any day, any time, whenever you're ready to make any donation in any size in any form. Garad says do your homework. Take contact information, go online, look it up, and confirm it's a real foundation. He says another way to get taken is through credit cards. Garad says online shopping is, for the large part, safe, as long as you stick to big, trusted websites. If you have any doubts about whether a website is legitimate or not, purchase whatever you're trying to purchase from a different site or purchase it in person. Just don't risk it. There will always be another option. If it's a legitimate product you're trying to buy, there will always be another place that you can find it from. Now, Garot says that once your credit card information is taken or a fraudulent donation is made, that money is probably gone, although you can contact your credit card company and file a claim. Reporting live, I'm Andy Hirschberger, WMUR News 9.